freaking morning. Welcome back to my channel. We're vlogging today. My arm doesn't extend any farther. You can see like my arm is fully stretched out and it's still very zoomed in on my face. So I need to get a different lens, but we're going to be doing a little bit of a reset day. I did a little bit of a reset yesterday. So we did like our meal prep, cleaning, all that stuff because we got back from our trip on Saturday. But today I need to clear out my closet a bit because I got stuff in my trip where there's things that I like bought to replace other things. So I just need to like clear it out, get sort of rid of some clothes. I cannot speak. And then change over my gym bag. So I got a new gym bag. Do a bunch of little getting together stuff and work. So I'm going to just take you through it. Do a little bit of a vlog day. And then we'll go to the gym together later as well. Because we're doing a leg day. It's my first workout back in like three weeks. So it's going to be a rough one. Okay. So all of this has to be gone through. All of this. As well as all of that. So let's let's just get into this. This is going to be a gong show. Okay. We're clearing out the closet because I have all of these new tops that I need to get rid of the old ones. So for starters, like things like this, I'm just like, I'm going to put these in PJs because I do wear them, but literally only for PJs. And for some reason I keep hanging them back up. So we're going to get rid of those type of shirts um, and just do that for now because I need PJ shirts. So I have a few and I did buy... Like, I literally, I bought this gray one, I bought it in white, and I also bought it in this, like, burgundy color. So, I love these. So, the reason I'm getting rid of stuff is because these are what I wear. Like, this is, like, me in a shirt. So, I have a few, um, like, this from Zara as well. So, when I found more of them, I was like, I gotta get them. So, we're gonna be replacing the things I don't wear because these are, I'm just, like, making my wardrobe me finally. So, we don't need all that extra stuff. I just bought this as well. This is a super cute little like front tie. So it's like very open. I'm gonna wear like a bralette under it. So I got some things for the summer to replace things that I don't need. Like I'm not gonna wear this. So we're gonna get rid of that because I don't like the straps on it. I feel like I should not put the hangers back up there. Again, pajama shirt because it's dirty. Because it's old. Okay, I've kept this shirt for like five years because I always thought I was going to wear it since it was Brandy Melville. And I just am not, I'm not going to wear it. And it's just, it's come to that. We need to accept it and move on. There's a couple shirts like this from like when I used to do pictures for RBL that I just don't wear. And this one's an extra small, so it's so tight. So it's not that I don't like it. It's just, it's not something I'm reaching for. And same goes for this tank top. So... We just need to do stuff to get rid of all of the clutter pajama shirt that I have that I don't need anymore. Like I bought this from Forever 21. Am I going to wear it? I don't know. I'm definitely not wearing this. So that needs to go. And then I have this pink one that I kind of like more than that nude one. But again, like, am I ever going to wear it? I don't know. We'll come back to it when I do another clear out this summer. See, I have two versions of this. I have like a t-shirt and then I have a long sleeve. I feel like I'm gonna keep the long sleeve. I'm gonna get rid of the t-shirt because I honestly haven't worn either of them in a long time. So we'll keep one and then see if we're gonna get rid of it. Cause I also have like the, I don't even know this is from, but I have like a long sleeve gray version. So. We will see. Getting rid of my Believe Supplements t-shirts. Don't need those. I'm so on edge about this because I feel like this could be so cute in the summertime, but at the same time, I'm not really going to wear it. We'll come back to it in the summer. And I got some like more t-shirts like this on my trip. So like clean basics. I have a white one as well. So the reason I got all these is because this is like me, like I said. So I'm rearranging my wardrobe. So it's literally only things that I actually like. I think it's finally time to retire the cropped racing shirt. I really like it. Maybe we'll just, we'll put it in the PJ drawer for now and then we'll see because I'm unsure. Oh, and I also got this on my trip. I'm obsessed. It was $9 at Forever 21. I think it's time to say goodbye to the Carhartt cropped because I accidentally cropped it too much. I think I'm going to get rid of this because I bought like a super long version. If you've seen it on my TikTok or if you're watching this on YouTube, go watch my TikTok. Um, and I don't wear this like 
ever because it's like tighter. So I like this one that I bought because it's bigger. Okay. What else? I feel like this stuff down here I've sifted through so many times and there's not much of it that there's nothing that I'm like ready to get rid of because I got rid of everything that I didn't want. So I think that's pretty good. I got rid of, like we made a good chunk of hangers. So we're doing good. And that's all I really needed was because I have clothes I need to hang up, but I have no hangers for them. And then, you know, we already went through that in the last time I did a clean out. So I got rid of everything I didn't want out of there. This was the only part I was having a hard time separating from, which is funny because like I don't need like half the stuff that's in here, but I just, I can't get rid of it. I'm trying my best to minimalize, but I have some hoarding tendencies. So we'll see how it goes later. These are my new Halara things, so we're gonna hang them up. And I will take the tag off eventually, so don't come at me for that part. I'm just too lazy to do that right now. I don't even have a color spot for this one. I forgot I had more laundry from the other day that I didn't hang up because I had no hangers. So I also got this really cute jumpsuit. It's like a little shorts one from Forever 21 because I'm too cheap to buy the Aritzia shorts one since I already bought the Aritzia long leg, like legging one and that was a lot of money. So I found that one. So that was sweet. I also got this, another one of like the shirts I'm kind of wearing, but it's from Target, not the other place that I got the rest of the three, but I like the style. So I had to get some more. Perfect. Okay. It's like 11.50. And I haven't finished drinking my smoothie. Okay. My game plan is we're gonna, I'm just putting away towels from yesterday's laundry. And then I think I'm gonna finish editing or start editing while I drink the rest of my smoothie. And then I'm gonna take you through what I'm making for lunch. Cause I actually made, oops, um, few new things for this week and I'm excited for it and I had one time had it oh my god I cannot speak I had it one yes uh, I had it once yesterday and it was really good so we're keeping it basic but delicious so I'm gonna go edit and zone out for a bit and then ow, we'll touch base in a minute okay I'm making lunch I have hit a serious wall i friday and saturday we drove 26 hours from california back home two days straight and yesterday we did like gross shop meal prep cleaned up the house i didn't really i got like a bit of relaxation but i feel like i needed a whole day of just like doing nothing and i have a lot of work to do today so all that's all i've been doing and i'm just hitting these walls of where like i just i feel like i'm gonna pass out i'm so tired um, but I'm making some food to fuel myself because it's definitely needed at this point. So I pre-cooked all my food yesterday aside from my shrimp for dinner. So I have like everything in the fridge made. Um, what I'm doing for lunches because this was something I ate a couple times when I was in California was salad. So I have just romaine lettuce and Parmesan cheese and ranch. This is the fat free or low cal. I don't remember which one it was. Calorie wise maybe. I think that's what it's called. Um, Caesar dressing. And I was supposed to put a hard boiled egg on it too. And then I forgot to make them. So we're just using extra chicken for protein right now. But I might make it if I feel more awake tomorrow. Right now I'm exhausted and I don't want to make anything. I'm also trying to decide, do I want to take a nap or do I want to drink a cup of coffee? I usually only drink one cup of coffee a day. And I had one this morning. I don't know what is the best thing to do right now. Done. This is why, even if it's a salad, you should prep your food because it makes lunchtime a lot easier. Good morning from 4 p.m. <laughs> I have been trying to recover from our trip and I am just so tired. And it's not because I was like on this extravagant, I cannot speak, extravagant thing. I just drove from the first to the third for three days. And then I drove on the 17th and 18th, two days, 26 hours. 
And then we just did a lot of stuff when we were there and I just never recovered from my sleep. I also, I grind my jaw so badly and I'm supposed to finally get to an appointment on like April 18th or something. Like it's taken like two months to even try to get a consultation for TMJ Botox because it's, it's ruining my life right now. I can't sleep. My head's always hurting. It's 4 p.m. I'm making a freaking coffee. I have work to do, but like, I, my head is throbbing, so I just tried to take a nap, and I don't feel any better. So we have a cup of coffee. I'm gonna go sit on the couch again and do a little more work if I can make my head stop hurting, and then try to go to the gym. Because Tanner is gonna be home soon, and that's not another thing I need to do today. But frick, I'm tired. Are you just chilling, honey? He's got his arm rested, like an arm rest on me. Is that you? <gasps> Is that you? Yeah, it's a good boy. Okay, last thing I need to do today to get ready for the gym. Oh, you're so cute. Is put everything in my new gym bag. So I got a backpack when I was in Palm Desert. Um, and I don't have everything in there. So we got our hip thrust pad, our belt, got our straps and also our wrist straps. You know, the ones that help not break your wrist when you're lifting heavy weights. Um, and then, you know, I'll add my sliders in there. I don't really need to switch everything over. Jump rope. I have so much stuff in this bag that I don't actually need. So we're gonna limit what we switch. More bands. I also have a snack pouch, so I'm gonna put that in there. That's everything that I need. Perfect. So, bag is full. It's so hard to shut. Ugh. There we go. Perfect. I'm gonna add my microphone in here in a minute. Do I have headphones? Yes. Okay, I got lots of snacks, headphones, and I just need my microphone and then my camera. And then we're good. So, got it all. Gym fit, oversized, Def Leppard t-shirt, navigation shorts, an Amazon sports bra. Now I gotta do something with my hair. I don't know what. The final gym fit look. I did my hair in like a little braided ponytail and I put a puppy jacket on because it's like remotely cold out. I tucked you know, because it's like day. Every girl does this. Sweatpants. I got some cool new socks from the Vans outlet. I have a Converse. And then I'm just going to be wearing the t-shirt and shorts and Converse when I get there. But I have to obviously dress for the weather because it's still freaking winter. Good morning. It's like two days later because I forgot. Well, I didn't forget. I was vlogging on... What day of the week is it? <clears throat> I was vlogging on Monday. And then yesterday I had like the busiest day. I started doing photography, so I had one of my friends be a little model for me. I'll put a couple pictures on the screen so you guys can see. But then I came home, I had to edit all the photos. I was working all night and I literally worked until like 9.30 and then went to bed. So I didn't vlog anything yesterday, but we're gonna continue this vlog today and then I'll end it tonight. But for today, we're going to do a little bit of work, go to the coffee shop to work more so I can like zone out because I zone out better when I'm there and then go to the gym. Maybe I'll show you this workout. I film all my workouts for like Instagram, like real versions as well as like TikTok. So it's hard for me to film it on here for YouTube at the same time. Cause sometimes I have to film every single set to get the clip I need for the reel. And then I have to do like an extra set to film it this way. So we'll see if I can get it in this video, but we're doing another leg day. The last one was a leg day. 
um, because I did legs and then I did back yesterday. I'm doing legs today and then I'm going to take tomorrow to do another upper body day and then we'll figure out because I have three leg days in a week because I do a hip thrust day, a squat day, and a deadlift day. So we'll see when I do the next, but I'm going to take you through the day and see what we get up to but it's not this is just like days in my life so nothing is like thrilling exciting adventures like we're literally just working so we'll see what we get up to a little 185 i'm probably gonna get like two reps and then die a little bit but that's okay as long as we try <sighs> yeah two is all we got today <laughs> because yesterday I forgot to film. So, um, I just spent my morning like cleaning and like I'm trying to take a little bit of a break from like posting so much on social media because I just have lost my love for it. Um, just because I've been trying, like I just feel like I'm just posting to post. So I kind of explained that on my Instagram, but I've been like just taking the morning, I cleaned, I made a bunch of really satisfying cleaning like TikToks. I just made another cup of coffee though because I am really tired because I'm still like recovering from our trip from like how exhausted I was from doing the drive. But I'm really, really trying to like get myself in a routine of filming. So I think what I'm gonna do is, rather than always stressing about filming, like vlogs starting like right when I get up in the morning, cause I get up at six, but when I get up in the morning, like I have a coffee, I read my book, I feed my dog, I let him out, I shower, do all my stuff. Like I'm very busy all at like a really short time frame cause I like to get everything done so I can get ready for the day. So I think I'm going to try to film more, but by not pressuring myself to do morning clips. Because I always try to do like making coffee, getting ready. And it's like when there's two of you in the house trying to get a bunch of stuff done with a crazy barking dog that wants to go outside, it's hard. So I'm definitely going to try to vlog more. I'm going to make it like a priority to post less stupid stuff on Instagram and post more vlogs because I would love to, I'd love this to grow because this is something I'm like super passionate about. I love filming. I love creating content, but it's hard to do it when it like never grows. It's very like discouraging, but also at the same time, like if you don't make money off of it and then you do something else, like I have my own business that I make money off of that like I need to prioritize. So like it's hard to like balance that for me. So we're going to make some changes, but this is going to be the weirdest vlog because I vlogged the first day yesterday. I said I was going to vlog. Um, I put the clips of the workout in there, but I only filmed them like real version. So I didn't even film the whole workout, so you kind of will see a couple, but um, today I'm just going to end this here and I'm going to restart because I do have a clothing video that'll go up maybe before this. It might come up after. I'm not 100% sure. Um, it'll be the Halara haul, so it's either going to be the one right before this one or the next one. I don't know when this is going up, but I have to edit this one and fix the other one because I had to do a couple changes for the company because it is a collab video. But other than that, thanks so much for watching. I appreciate every single one of you that are on my channel and that have supported me and have followed me or subscribed to me, I guess would be the best word on here, um, and watch my videos because it means the world to me because I love doing this. It just gets very discouraging sometimes when it doesn't like grow, when you're putting so much effort in. And I definitely stopped for a long time because of that. So I'm trying to bring it back, trying to be more myself because I feel like I'm always, I've always been trying like, what, what's, what do I have to be to be the best of this? Or how do I grow on this? Like, who do I have to act like? Like, I want to just be me. So this is my year of just doing everything I want to do, being my best self. And I'm going to take you guys through that journey. So thank you for watching. I hope you have the best freaking day ever. And I will see you guys next week as we start to vlog more.